Last year, I started this channel. One of the videos that I posted was about why I won't pay off my mortgage at this current time. And every single day, I get people telling me that I'm wrong. Most of them incredibly rude about it. Hey everybody, welcome back to Drawbridge Finance. My name is Levi Woods, and this is an opinion channel about money. I'm gonna make this video to show you guys exactly why I chose last year not to pay down my mortgage, and why today I'm still gonna make that same decision. I woke up this morning, I went to the bank, and I got some cash. And I'm gonna show you so that you all know, because I know there's people out there that are gonna look at this and they're gonna go through the details and count every little penny that I've put out there. So, first off, this is a loony. It is worth $1 in Canada. This is a toonie. It is worth $2 in Canada. Blue bills, $5. Purple bills, $10. Green bills, $20. Red bills, $50. Brown bills, my favorite, $100. Stack of 20s with a single elastic on them, $1,000. Stack of 20s, white band, $2,000. Stack of 20s. Double elastic, $5,000. Brick, $5,000 times eight, $40,000. Let's get over to the bench. It's a 25 year mortgage. This is an IOU, $91,262 remain at 2.29%. Monthly payment, $985.48. 102 months left in the term. All of the people that would pay off their mortgage and me. This is January 2017. There's $91,262 still owing. Let's look at the investment account. That's your 91,000. We're both equal in this scenario. Now, for those of you who would pay off your mortgage, take this 91,000 and give it to the bank. You are now mortgage free. Your investment is gone. Because I still have a mortgage, I have to come up with $985 every single month for the rest of the year. And I have to give that money to the bank to pay down my mortgage. You on the other hand are mortgage free. So you have an extra 985 bucks that you can put into your investment account. Good luck catching up to me. Now that you guys have seen that basic math, I know that every single person wants to know how much interest did I pay? $1,987. After I paid that $1,987, I made $19,626. $19,000 after I paid this piddly $1,900. Not to rub it in, that's $1,635 a month more. Now I know you guys have a second question. Is this real money? Of course not. I'm a prop builder. This is prop money. If you guys are interested, check out my other channel, Drawbridge Props, it's really interesting. If you feel like this was a bad video, go watch another video, no harm, no foul. If it was a good video, give me a thumbs up, leave a positive comment. Please subscribe so I can show you how to make this from this. Let's get rich together, talk soon.